Okay, so we are on our way back to uh, home. home, to home. Uh, to make it a bit more useful for you guys, we have posted an Instagram story in which you could ask, ask us the questions. questions. Ask us questions, and we are gonna answer some of them now. So let's start off with first question. How do you deal with an arch elbow if you have experience with it? And I suppose that it means like an injury what? to your, to your <laughs> elbow. Um, how do you deal with an elbow? You are the expert on injuries uh, lately. You go to the physio, listen to what the physio says, do exactly what the physio says, and don't shoot too much. Yeah. And if you mean how do you deal with an archer's elbow as in my elbow needs to be higher or lower or whatever, just do whatever feels comfortable and uh, seems logical according to your coach. And don't overdo anything. Next question. Do you receive extra filaments for extra power? No. No. It's not natural pain. Yeah, we have enough power for ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> what is your motivation to train hard? The fact that it's fun. Yeah. It should stay fun uh, always. If it's not fun anymore, we just stop shooting. And for me, like competitions, like big competitions, competitions also help to motivate me to train. What kind of target butts do you use at the training center in the Netherlands? The actual targets are, I think, mostly 11. Yeah, 11 with like and those yellow and inserts. Yeah, we have some uh, domino denage kind of things, and uh, we have the the, the the stands with the wheels. They are self-made, so somebody made yeah. them for the OTC. Why did Chef cut his hair until almost bald? What do you mean? Uh, you don't have hair anymore. <laughs> um, uh, because it gives me less headache. Normally I wake up with a headache and uh, ever since I cut off my hair I don't wake up with headaches or I wake up with less bad headaches. And that was enough reason for me to do it and to test it. And I tested it and I think I'm going to keep it like this because it's easy, cheap, gives me less headaches and no uh, hair that's uh, uh, people give me comments about it and I uh, like to be the center of attention. Is <laughs> it uh, Fricada or Fricandel? Fricandel. Kijk, ik moet heet die camera zo hoog vol, maar dat is hartstikke zwaar voor alarm joh. Next question is um, what kind of color of vein will you recommend? They recommend spinning veins and I'm sure guys will recommend you spider veins. Yeah. Because that's what works best for the two of us. Yeah. So I suggest just testing some and see which vein gives you the smallest group. And then just shooting those and uh, picking the color that you like. I found like softer veins work better. Durability is uh, worse. Yeah. So you will have to spend a little more on veins and shoot better groups is what our experience is. Wouldn't you would. Uh, how many hours do you shoot in one day? Somewhere in between 150 and 250. Why did Jeff cut his hair? What was your best improvement during your stay in Dautzing? Your veins? Oh yeah, I flexed all my hair, so my veins improved. Um, I have tested some stuff with sweaty hands because it's uh, easy in the center to get sweaty hands because it's indoor and it's warm. And so. Uh, which is useful for Tokyo, because in Tokyo I also get sweaty hands. I had a week of archery, um, so it was the, this was the first few days that I was shooting again. So I just tried to make good shots, make strong shots, and actually it went pretty well. So I guess my improvement was uh, my arrow value and my uh, just my overall technique. Uh, so next question, why did Chef shave his head? What was your first bow? My first bow was a uh, Hoyt Matrix. Actually a really good bow with uh, some winner win old limbs. And uh, I bought it second hand. And everyone was telling me that I had to like start off with a simple wooden bow or maybe like beginner bow. And I was like, nah, I just buy a second hand bow that I like. It was a pretty good idea. I had a Royal, a wooden bow. And then after that I had a Semic Progress one, which was my first like, proper bow and uh, I still have some fun memories of it. A tip to improve mental game. I think that's really personal for everyone. Like we said before, 
um, have fun really worked for I think for everyone in our team have more fun makes you uh, less judging about bad shots and it will make it easier to make like good shots and maintaining make good shots um, so that's I think the biggest part who will shoot 600 indoor and what is your favorite what who will shoot 600 indoor I think in my life I will shoot a 600 but I'm not sure I will be the first one and my favorite is uh, pasta carbonara <laughs> <laughs> My favorite is the Irish pub burger I ate yesterday. Um, it was basically two uh, toasts with burgers on it, um, two eggs, a shitload of hey. uh, <laughs> shitload of, <laughs> of bacon uh, with fries and chips and salad, and it was just too much. What have you done to your hair? Well, um, I just put some gel. Uh, oh, you mean sure. What do you mean? I think they mean you. I don't have any hair. <laughs> What do you think every archer should know going into a competition or in general? Always shoot towards the target. Yeah. <laughs> Archery is a very fair play sport, so don't be an asshole on the line. Uh, respect each other and just make sure that everybody has as much fun as possible. Why did no. Jeff shave his head? <laughs> so. Turbo. So, next question, why did Jeff shave his head? Um, after how many years of practice you shot your first 60 at 70 meters? Mine first was in 2000, begin 2016. I shot three years now. I have no idea, and I've been shooting since I was very little, so probably a lot of years. What's your brace head at the factor? 23.7. And mine is 23.6. So that's actually a high one. The maximum, according to Hoyt, is uh, 24.0. I prefer a, a higher one, Chef does also. The reason behind it is that I get better groupings and I have no other reason than that. Favorite distance to shoot? 70 meters. 70 meters? Chef, may I ask you why you switched back to spin wings? Yes, you may. I, I, get, I get tired of Chef sometimes. Annoying. <laughs> um, because they gave me better groups. Uh, where is Chef's hair? Like in the bin, I think, somewhere. Like at home or at the hairdresser? She chef. Chef's getting, chef getting sad. Everyone asking that. <laughs> what we are doing at the Bite Center, something specific or just ordinary practice? Uh, actually, uh, for me, it was ordinary practice and test some knocks. Uh, for Chef, it was... Uh, just for fun. Just for fun. I just like to go there and uh, see the company and see the guys again. And uh, it's also always nice to tune your bow at 70 meters indoor. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs>